A 76-year-old woman who represented herself in a case of age discrimination has won her battle. Rezia Harrison gained a first-class degree in psychology at the age of 70 and decided she would like to retrain as a psychoanalyst. But her application was turned down three times because she was told she was just too old. Victoria Graham reports. I was terribly upset. I don't think it's possible, really, to, for people who haven't been discriminated against, prejudiced against, to understand actually what it feels like. It's terribly annihilating. You feel really crushed. Rejected three times because of her age. But thanks to Mrs Harrison's years as a barrister, she was able to represent herself in a case she felt was not only of importance to her, but to others wishing to continue to work later in life. They said that they thought I would need to live for quite a long time in order to not, uh, in order to have continuity with the patients, which is not unreasonable, of course, but I think the difficulty is that we none of us can show how long we're going to live. A court agreed with her. And furthermore, a judge found that at least some of the members of the admissions committee were actively looking to block the claimant's application if they could under the law because they considered that it was not appropriate for someone of that age to commence training as a psychoanalyst. I think it's a great pity that it's so expensive to bring a case. I think if I would have loved to have legal representation, but if I had had, it would have cost me maybe 50 or 100,000 pounds. When I spoke to Mrs. Harrison this morning, I asked her what she wanted to come out of the remedial session taking place here at court in Hoban today. And she said she didn't want compensation. She just wanted to be accepted on the course by the Institute which had rejected her so many times. We acknowledge the findings of the, 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 the tribunal. Uh, we will obviously uh, look at our procedures and review them in the light of, the, light of these findings. Uh, we've also uh, apologised uh, to Mrs Harrison. Despite that apology and £21,500 awarded in damages, Mrs Harrison still wasn't allowed to enrol on the course. But she's currently training to become a psychoanalyst at the Tavistock and Portman. She'll be 80 when she completes it. I'm very surprised that the case has gone this far because the law is very clear about this. You can't discriminate against people on the basis of their age in education and, and, and training. But I think it's a really important result because what it says to people is you're never too old uh, to take, it, take her part in the education, the training that you want to take part in at any stage of life. So many older people are brainwashed into thinking they have to retire, have to sit and do their gardens. And gardens are lovely, but they're a spare time occupation. Rosia Harrison ending that report by Victoria Graham.